What's going on guys? I'm bringing another quiz video today and this one's pretty cool. We're going to try and name every NHL team to ever exist. Uh, so obviously you have all the teams that, you know, folded, relocated, all that good stuff. I was actually 61 here in total. We have 12 minutes to try and finish this. I'm thinking we probably won't use the entire time. We'll probably just run out of ideas. I do have an idea of like a lot of them. Obviously you have the 31 teams that exist now. Then we have to actually come up with 30 more. So I'm hoping to get like 45, maybe half of the teams that used to exist. And obviously every team that exists now we should know. And as you can see here, we're given the location for every single team. But we have to come up with the team nicknames. So definitely be guessing some like random ones. Um, also it has notes and facts here. Not sure what that is. I'm guessing probably like... Uh, the time that the team existed, you know, 1900s to 2000, whatever. So uh, I guess we'll get started here again. I'm hoping for about 45, 75%. We should at least get the 31, obviously. So play quiz. Here we go. I guess we'll just work our way backwards. So uh, Golden Knights there. Yeah, so yeah, it is the year 2017 to present. Kind of what I figured. Um, Minnesota Wild. Also, while we're here, don't forget the North Stars, 67 to 93. Then move to Dallas. Uh, that's so It actually tells you exactly what happened and the years they existed. So that's really cool. Uh, Columbus Blue Jackets will be the next one. Uh, Winnipeg Jets. We actually get two. The new Winnipeg Jets and the old one. 79 to 96. Moved to Phoenix and became a canine nuisance. I love that. Uh, so I guess while we're there, Coyotes. We get both Phoenix and Arizona. So a double whammy. Uh, don't know why I said that. Uh, San Jose Sharks. Uh, we have Ottawa Senators right below them. Oh wow, we get two Ottawa Senators. I didn't know that. So they existed from one of the original four franchises. Before the original six, 1917-1934, moved to St. Louis, taking a patriotic bird as their mascot. Did not know that. So there's going to be two St. Louis, one blue, and one that bird. So probably eagle? E maybe eagles? There we go. St. Louis eagles. I didn't know they existed. They only existed for one year, and then they folded. So I guess that's why. Uh, going back to the other side, we need Tampa Bay Lightning. Um, we want the Anaheim Ducks there. Can't spell apparently. Obviously, too, we want the Mighty Ducks. I prefer that logo way, way more. Um, I think they dropped Mighty because like Disney used to own them, and now they no longer do. Uh, Florida Panthers, Nashville Predators. It's like spelling there is gonna kill us. Atlanta Thrashers. There's also the Atlanta Flames. I knew that they came the Calgary Flames. Obviously, 72 to 80, they moved to Calgary, and yeah, still the Flames. Thrashers, 99 to 2011, then flew north. Foreseeable future. Um, so up there we have the Colorado Avalanche. Above them though, Quebec. So that is the t-shirt I'm rocking here. I figured it was a kind of fitting t-shirt to wear for this quiz. We have the uh, Quebec Nordiques. I also got like a pretty sick Hartford Whalers uh, long sleeve shirt at the same store. So NHL vintage store in Mall of America, Minnesota. Highly recommend. 79 to 95, moved to Colorado. I think they won the Stanley Cup like, what, four years later or something. Uh, Carolina Hurricanes there, Hartford Whalers. Just mentioned that shirt I had. 79 to 97, so they existed for almost 20 years. I know, personally, one of my favorite logos ever. A lot of people, too, when I was wearing that shirt, were all commenting, loving the logo. Um, LA Kings there, I just looked at. So we have the Edmonton Oilers, Washington Capitals. Again, spelling, just, I can't type for some reason. Uh, New Jersey Devils, another Colorado team. Oh, that's right. Um, I'm blanking on what it is. Hopefully, we can remember. Kansas City, so that's the Kansas City Scouts. I know that one. 74 to 76, then moved to Colorado and renamed the, to match the mountains. Oh, so Colorado Rockies. There we go. So just like baseball. I, is that a baseball team, right? 76 to 82, moved to New Jersey and changed the name to local superstition. Oh, wow. So the Kansas City Scouts became the Colorado Rockies, became the New Jersey Devils. Um, New York, I'm not sure. Is that the Rangers? The Rangers are up there. Islanders, that is the Islanders. 72 to present. Rangers, 26 to present. Obviously, original six. Uh, Vancouver Canucks, Buffalo Sabres, St. Louis. We have the other St. Louis team there, the Blues. Pittsburgh Penguins. I know there's actually another Pittsburgh team on the left side there. I think Pirates. Yeah, I remember we were doing another quiz. It says something about Pittsburgh Pirates, and I thought they were like, trying to confuse us with the baseball team. But yeah, Pittsburgh Pirates, 25 to 30, then moved to Philadelphia. It's kind of funny. Uh, changed name to Large Local Religious Group. So that's not the Flyers. I'm not sure what that one's going to be. Uh, Dallas Stars, Cleveland, I know this one's Cleveland Barons. I believe they became Dallas, or no, they became Minnesota North Stars became Dallas. I know if you play NHL, you get a lot of hints when you're like looking through all the jerseys and you see the old ones. Uh, so California, that's the Golden Seals. It's like the teal and gold logo. It's kind of cool. Um, 70 to 76, moved to Cleveland, who then moved to North Stars. So it's kind of crazy seeing all these franchises, what used to exist. Oakland. Ah, uh, no idea on Oakland. Also, there's another California. I only knew the California Golden Seals. 
I know there's like two different logos. One's the logo, one it says seals. I'm not sure on that other one. Uh, Detroit, obviously, we have the Red Wings. We also have the Detroit Cougars. I'm really hoping uh, Seattle's gonna name their team the Cougars. Such a lame name. That's like Bulldogs, Wildcats, everyone uses it. Uh, the other one, named to a bird. Yeah, right, that's Detroit Falcons. Uh, so Chicago, we have Blackhawks. Oh wow, we get two for Blackhawks. Okay, I wasn't sure when I saw two Chicago's, I was like, I don't know what the other one's gonna be. So 26 to 86, 60 years, then got rid of the name in their, or got rid of the space in their name and just Blackhawks. I can't believe they count that as two. Okay, I honestly never even realized that though. Uh, the other Philadelphia, large religious group. So like, I don't know, the, <laughs> what would it be like, Flyer, the priests or the Christian, the Christians? That's not a thing. Uh, the Catholics, the Popes, like what would a large religious group be? I have no idea what that Philly one is. Uh, Montreal obviously is the Canadians. There's actually three. So the first one there, one of the original four franchises, 1917 to present. Okay, Toronto Maple Leafs, we also have three others. Uh, February 14th, 1927 to present. You have the Toronto Arenas, I know that. Uh, they only existed for a year and I still knew about them. Then changed their name to honor a famous saint. Okay, obviously St. Pat's, St. Patrick's. 1919 to 1927, then changed the name to Canadian flag symbol. Another Toronto team, Maple Leafs, St. Pat's, Arenas. I don't know what the other one is. There's also another, Mon there's two more Montreal teams. I know there was a Montreal Maroons. That was a different team, never mind. Uh, 24 to 38, then folded. Okay, uh, I thought that they became the Canadians. <laughs> Apparently not. So I'm not sure what those last two Montreal and Toronto. There's also another Quebec team, another Hamilton team. Uh, there is the Hamilton Tie Cats. Try Tiger Cats. Tie. There we go, Hamilton Tigers. 1920-25, uh, folded following a player's strike. It seems like a lot of the old team names became new team names, whether it be CFL, the Tie Cats, Pittsburgh Pirates, Carl Rockies, another baseball team. So I guess for that we could try, what is it, Quebec? Ramparts, I think, was a CHL team. No good. Uh, Toronto. Oh, Marley's? AHL. Uh, Bulldogs. is the Hamilton Bulldogs. And that is the Quebec team, actually. I was thinking Hamilton Bulldogs AHL team. Uh, 1919 to 1920. Then moved to Hamilton, changed into Big Cat. Okay, so that makes sense. And then obviously went back to Hamilton Bulldogs. So speaking of like the main team names, you got Cougars, you got Bulldogs, Wildcat. Wildcats, Wildcat. I'm thinking of like the high school names everyone uses. Mustangs, so a popular one. Huskies, no good. Um, okay, so we're at 53 of 61. We're doing so much better than I expected. I thought like 45 would be a good score. Uh, Brooklyn, do we try Nets? Not really gonna match for hockey, obviously. California, I thought it was only the Golden Seals. Oakland, I mean, I'm just putting in like other team names. Hopefully, you know, they used it twice. Um, Boston, oh, did I not put Boston Bruins? That They've been so embarrassing. We need seven more. Um, Philly, the other Philly one, yeah, I'm like, I, actually wait, maybe like the Liberty Bells or something? Is that Philadelphia? Liberty, um, New York, Metro Metropolitan, is that team? That was a Seattle team, apparently not on here though. Um, Montreal, can eat Habs? Straight up just Habs, no. Um, it probably does start with an H and that's where the Habs nickname came from. So, have, have it all. <laughs> I don't know, I think that's a French word. Uh, Toronto, I can't, I can't even think of anything. We're probably just gonna have to bail out here. Try like a few more guesses. Brooklyn, I, I didn't know Brooklyn had an NHL team aside from the Islanders. And then the Rangers, the old logos, New York. Met no, I don't, I don't know what the New York one is. The other Toronto team though, no idea. Maple Leafs, St. Pat's, Arena. has already tried Marley's. Uh, Toronto, I mean like Nationals, uh, Canada, uh, I'm trying to think, Northern Americans, oh shit, New York and Brooklyn Americans, let's go, that's awesome, 1925, 1941, and then 1941 to 42, one year, suspended operations during World War II, uh, franchise canceled in 46. You know you have an old fra franchise when you have to suspend you to World War II, jeez. So we got, yeah, Montreal, Toronto, Philly, o California, Oakland. We got so lucky with that one. I mean, we could keep guessing, but pretty much out of ideas here. 12 seconds later. All right, guys, so I think I'm gonna throw in the towel here. I was thinking about it for like 30 seconds. I can't come up with anything. So uh, we have the one Montreal, the one Toronto, uh, the old Philadelphia, and then one of the Californias and Oakland, which I didn't even realize was a team. 
56 to 61 though, I'm pretty happy with that. We're gonna give up here, I can't think of it. Montreal Wanderers, that sounds familiar now that I like, see it, but I would not have thought of that. Toronto Blue Shirts, never heard of that. One of the original four franchises, only existed for a year, then changed the name to Toronto Arenas, which also only existed for a year. Um, California Seals, are you kidding me? <laughs> I was so close on that one. I, I remember thinking like the logo, which said Seals across it. So that was like Seals before Golden Seals. That one's annoying, so I should have gotten that one, which would have given us, what, 58 to 61? Has it taken both California and Oakland? I figured these two were obviously related. 67, changed location to Oakland, and then obviously California added, added location to Golden Gate Bridge, the color, whatever. Uh, Philadelphia Quakers. I thought Quakers like slang. I didn't know that was a religious group. Okay, I, I would not have guessed that one, but seals without golden seals. Like I could even picture the logo, just the word on the front of the jersey. That one's annoying. So 56 to 61, still uh, 92%. Average score 69%. Nice. Uh, so we definitely destroyed the average score there. Should have had 58. Like we put in golden seals. We had half of the name, right? I, I wish if we'd have accidentally put seals first. What do we got the two? That's okay. So let's see here how everyone else does on these. So still put us in the same bracket, which is good. 56 to 60. 30% uh, of people actually got that. Less than 2% got perfect. Uh, majority there, 41 to 45, which of course is what I was shooting for, that 45. Uh, so still top four, or what did that be? Top 15% there. Pretty happy with that. Um, again, I was just hoping for 45. We got 56 to 61. We'll call it 58. We had we had half of that name there. We even described the jersey, and basically the last three minutes was just you know hoping for something, which we didn't get there with uh, what was it? The Americans. That was just complete luck. So. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this quiz. I was a lot of fun, honestly. Definitely learned some history too. I like the notes and facts showing when the teams existed, who they became, uh, kind of what made them fold and stuff like that, why they relocated. So really enjoyed this one. Hopefully you guys did too. If you did enjoy it, please leave that thumbs up. Also, if you haven't subscribed yet, please do that. And if any of you guys tried out this quiz for yourselves, uh, post your scores in the comments section. I'd love to hear if you did better than me. If someone got perfect, that would be insane. But that's gonna be it guys for this video. As always, thank you so much for watching. Have a nice day. Goodbye.